so now I'll be teaching a new topic called swept base for that you need to make a new part okay left click once this opens I want to draw something I'll go directly to sketch I will draw a rectangle and I will select the front plane this is another different method to open the part either uh, select the sketch the the uh, features in the sketch and then select the plane or else first select the plane and then draw the geometric shapes here I have directly taken the corner rectangle the sketch features and then I will select the, the front plane by front plane top plane right plane I will select the front plane left click once you do the left click yeah, you can what you can do is from this is the origin from the origin I am drawing a random part a random rectangle without any smart dimensions so this rectangle has been made right click ok this is made this was made in front plane as you can see it is parallel to front plane but now I want to draw a swift how I will draw the swift you see I will select the top plane the top plane is selected this is the top plane on this I want to draw some arc or some few lines so what I can do is I will select mm, the line the line feature once I select the line feature I will draw will click left click and then I will start drawing the lines when I do this thing right click and check what I can see is I am making on the same plane so here I don't want to make into same plane I want to make into different plane so what to do back and I will delete this sketch other than deleting this whole sketch make it control set control set see it's going control set control set yes it's going I want to make something in the top plane I don't want to make in the front plane so for that I need to make it back I want to make something in top plane then I will select the top plane I want to make a line the line has been selected now I will open this thing now where I want to make I want to make on this sketch on this sketch so I will start making a random lines over here ok and chain enough look now I have made perpendicular this was right click this was the front plane in which the rectangle was made and this is this this spline the sketch too is a spline is being made in the top plane now it is being parallel to top plane now see what happens back now see what happens I will choose features and then I will go to swept how the option swept boss or base is going to work there are two different sketches we will open the tree or and select the sketch or directly go to sketch and select here this is number two this is number one so sketch number one is this which is this one it is being selected now sketch one and this becomes sketch two they complete or directly you can go from here and select like this look the preview look the preview make it okay look this is made this is some kind of structure is being made now to alter this structure go right click and edit feature I want to make some changes over here so what kind of changes can I make I need to make some changes in the sketch itself so make it cross cancel it open this thing this is a plus over here yes there are two sketch this sketch or this I want to make in this sketch there is sketch I don't want this I want it uh, this way I want it uh, something uh, something a little bit straight and uh, not this is too much this over here and then uh, kind of simple simple part okay okay 
and then back look look I have swept apart but now let's try the same thing with the help of a circle so go to file go to new new part okay same thing with the circle here I'll be selecting sketch circle front plane this is the origin so a little bit away from the origin and it comes to the origin finally like this okay make it okay and then see what you can make what you can make through the option through this option here again the same thing this was made in front plane I want to make it in top plane so how to make in top plane is select the line once you select the line zoom it you should get a point over here this is the origin this is a point over here so you can make from any of these points let's make something from this point okay right click and chain see whether this is made in front oh this is made in, t in front plane this is not made in top plane again never repeat this mistakes make it control Z this diagram was made in front plane now I need to make in top plane so it should come over here somewhere now make it back once you make it back go to line select the line once you select the line you need to open up the part now this is the tree on the right hand side once you open up the tree the design tree here you need to select the top plane and now you need to again select it let's try one more time let's try yes you can find this thing here you just select it this should be selected the top plane should be selected now you can start drawing once the top plane gets selected it's done right click and chain now have a look no 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 so again again you are not on the right track you need to check why this feature is not working so again if this is not working from us make it control set you know this is the origin and you need to make something in top plane so top plane make it normal once you make it normal and then you can start selecting a line so take this line and then from here the top plane is already selected you need to know yes here comes here comes but don't select anything at the center because it won't work for you if you select this center so you want to work here somewhere again zoom it unless three dots appear you can't do anything you really can't do anything let's try here whether this line works or not but it should be this is a sketcher avoid this sketcher okay now select the line and open the tree select the top plane and start drawing and zoom it up till here and right click and chain make it back yes now you are done so this is the feature go to feature left click and swap page pause two sketches this is the first this is the second this becomes the second right click there are some errors why there are some errors cross it because the 
the circle is not able to take this profile so need to change something in sketch too okay here the angle is too high so make it like this now let's check a little bit yes now let's check whether it is making or not if back this is back so base pause this is first and this is second and then right click oh no this is not making this is not working it seems a huge a huge 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 error in this let's see one more time this is sketch 2 and then right click edit sketch and make it straight make it straight again left click and then features sorry back and then swap base pause two things it should touch the circle it is not touching this circle you understand so for touching the circle you need to select left click on this point and control left click on this diagram unless this thing touches the circle you cannot do anything it won't create a swept for you so this this circle should be selected this is selected and this dot should be selected should have some kind of relation So you can see such type of mistakes do happen in making a swift so this for this option you need to be very 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 careful so you will select sketch 2 and directly delete it yes this is deleted now again uh, be very cautious how to make it how to make this sketch you have made the sketch first sketch now for second sketch the profile sketch what you need to do is you need to select the top plane this is the top plane once the top plane is selected you need to draw some features in top plane then select a line and then from this point yes from this point start drawing something and zoom it and then just draw something right click engine again now we will check whether this is connected or not yes it is it is yes it is connected so don't you worry don't you worry this time finally it is going to work back and then features swept base open up the tree first scratch second sketch yes it's done it's done look look what kind of shape I made but definitely the sweeping action is working now it's a time to do some kind of modification in this so open up the uh, sketch 2 I will make some modification in sketch 2 edit sketch and then the modifications will be look I want some different shapes this is too 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 far like this something like this again like this and then oh yeah it goes down it should go up yeah so let's see how this works this is a bit small okay back look the shape kind of pipe structure 
which is being made uh, and now your uh, different uh, a little bit of change I can make is like s click here uh, make a sketch make this go zooming and then from this dead center make a circle and then once you make the circle back here here I want to make something mm, what to make uh, this this is a circle which is made on the top of it but my plan is to make this complete thing hollow so this circle won't help so new sketch 4 doesn't help me so rather than making a new sketch what you need to do is first of all delete this yes and then directly go to first sketch and then edit sketch here here it's very important to select one more from the center this is uh, one more circle it's okay and then back look look this becomes hollow completely hollow do you understand now the difference this is completely hollow so don't make a new sketch here just go to the old sketch and edit that sketch to make this part hollow so this is again a different feature and need to be very careful with what kind of new sketches you are making and what the already existing sketches are being modified so some imagination is really necessary in this case where a pipe is made and what kind of pipe you need with what kind of sweep such sweeps can also be made with the help of splines so if this is the second sketch then we'll edit the sketch once we go to edit sketch what we need to do is for example if I'm deleting this thing this particular thing delete here click delete here, click here delete click here delete instead of this thing I will use a spline once I will use a spline see how the curvature moves and how this thing becomes a real pipe right click and spline we'll check we'll check we'll not make mistake this time okay it's perfect let's go back let's go back quickly and this is showing some error close it after deleting the profile to this sketch 2 what we can do is we can select this spline and we need to be very careful that the orange dot appears and this dot should be clicked once and then we can draw a simple a simple spline not uh, the spline which is having a lot of curvatures this is a simple spline right click and spline and then make it back look this is made this is done this is done so again we'll go right click and then we'll go sketch Th this opens up a new sketch which we don't want so we'll go back there are two sketches one sketch and two sketch this is the profile which we have selected so we go this sketch again edit it and then by making another small circle inside it and then back look it's done this pipe is done with the help of spline so this is called sweep and here it ends our topic of sweep